And here we go again on another Dadget video. Dadget. What's going on, everybody? Dadget coming to you live from the road to work as per usual. And I'm not really live, but you know what I mean. Anyway, so uh, I woke up, uh, or I went, before I went to bed last night, uh, my face was quite dirty, I noticed. I looked at the mirror, so, uh, you know, being a mechanic now, I get kind of greasy. Well, I always did, but... Anyways, uh, so I'm looking in the mirror, I'm like, geez, I really need to wash my face. So I start washing my face. Well, uh, all of a sudden, I'm, you know, I was pretty aggressive, I guess. You know, my face was pretty dirty. But all of a sudden, I get blood all over the place. What the fuck just happened? And all of a sudden, I realize it's my nose. I have a nosebleed. I'm fucking damn near 40. I've never had a nosebleed other than like when I got punched in the nose, my nose bleeds. But other than that, my nose don't bleed. Never has. But fucking gushed. It was just like drip, 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 pour. And I was like, holy fuck, I've never had a nosebleed like that. Well, I've never had a nosebleed, let alone one like that. That was a pretty good one. But it was just pouring, like pretty much gushing out of my head. So uh, I had to you know, do the whole thing where you pinch it off for 10 minutes. Luckily it did pinch off, but holy fuck, that was quite a surprise. Uh, luckily, I was sitting in front of the, or I was washing my face at the time, right in front of the sink. So it was no biggie. Once the gut blood started gushing, I just leaned over the sink. Like, oh shit. But, uh, yeah, you know, that would be quite messy if it happened somewhere else. Or if you were wearing good clothes or something. You know, that would be real tricky not to, you know, destroy them. Because blood tends to fucking be a pain in the ass. But yeah, that was quite a surprise for me, the nosebleed from hell, you know, out of nowhere, just gush, you know. It be, wouldn't be so bad if, you know, I got them before, but it really took me by surprise where I've never had nosebleed before. Um, but yeah, as you might have noticed, uh, my YouTube is back normal. Oh, I'm at the spot. This is the spot, guys. See these sides and them trees? This is the spot. My last video that I uploaded yesterday also had the same thumbnail. Maybe even this one will. It's gonna be kind of funny if like I have a week of videos that have all the same thumbnail. Even though I didn't start at the same time or end at the same time. It seems to like pick up that spot as the thumbnail for some reason. The beauty of beige water it is. Oh boy, I forgot I gotta mow. I might have to mow this weekend. I might wait till next weekend. But uh, yeah, I don't know. My face just started to gush and there's blood everywhere. But I'm not dead yet. It obviously healed right up. I actually, my blood clots really well. Uh, so that's not much of an issue really. But uh, yeah, Friday, Friday, Friday. My favorite day because it's payday. It's the end of the week. Girlfriend's gone for the night, so I'm gonna get hammered. <laughs> I don't know if I will or not, but I'll definitely get drunk because it is Friday and that's what I do Friday nights. But uh, it's been a good week. Getting a little more adjusted to the whole new job, you know. It's definitely a little different, but that's okay. I don't mind the commute, you know. As you guys can tell, and you're proud of it most of the time, it's not that bad of a commute in the mornings. It's going to be a little interesting when it gets icy. The roads start getting a little slippy, but uh, that's a few few months yet, hopefully, anyways. But, uh, yeah, hopefully, yeah, uh, maybe I'll get some video this weekend of uh, a four-wheeler or something, I don't know. I know, I've actually been surprised how many views there are on my four-wheeler video that I did about a year ago. My four-wheeler's changed fairly dramatically since then. It's not black anymore, it's blue. It's, Killed all the paint off it. Uh, as a winch, if I didn't have a winch before, I got a plow, bigger tires, yada yada yada. Just did the rear main seal in it a few weeks ago. Uh, I was out for a ride, me and my buddy, and we got we were way back in the woods, like three kilometers, four kilometers back in the woods, and uh, we were stopped at this lake. And we went down to check the lake out, come back up. There's a huge puddle of oil under my bike. It's like, uh oh, that's not good. 
and uh, it caught on my swing arm, which was really weird. But it turned out what had happened was my rear main seal went and filled my swing arm full of oil, like it leaked out through the rear main seal into the swing arm, filled the whole swing arm full of oil, and then it was actually leaking out of the swing arm. So uh, I just found, found the leak and you know, fixed the rear main seal, but that was quite a surprise. <laughs> I didn't know uh, what that was. At first, at first I thought the rear end of that gun was leaking everywhere, but uh, no, it's the rear main. But eight eight dollar seal, I think, or maybe ten dollar seal. It took me like three hours to take it apart. Another few hours to put it back together. Two, maybe not even that long. Probably only three hours altogether, maybe four. But still, glad to have it all fixed though. That's I like to drive my bike. I'll probably go for a bike ride some hunt this weekend. I went and wanted to go the last couple of weeks, just never really got to. I did go last weekend for a quick little rip, but I need to go for a good bike ride. But anyways guys, I'm almost to work, so uh, as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for being a subscriber if you are. If you're not, feel free to hit that there button. And uh, stay tuned for these here videos. Anyways, until next time, Dad Jad out. Peace.